the mule deer is a deer indigenous to western North America, it is named for its ears, which are large like those of the mule. The several subspecies include the black-tailed deer. Unlike the related white-tailed deer, Adocoileus virginianus, mule deer are generally more associated with the land west of the Missouri River, and more specifically with the Rocky Mountain region of North America. Mule deer have also been introduced to Argentina and Kauai, Hawaii. The most noticeable differences between white-tailed and mule deer are the size of their ears, the color of their tails, and the configuration of their antlers. In many cases, body size is also a key difference. The mule deer's tail is black-tipped, whereas the white tails is not. Mule deer antlers are bifurcated. They fork as they grow, rather than branching from a single main beam, as is the case with white tails. Each spring, a buck's antlers start to regrow almost immediately after the old antlers are shed. Shedding typically takes place in mid-February, with variations occurring by locale. Although capable of running, mule deer are often seen starting, with all four feet coming down t in addition to movements related to available shelter and food. The breeding cycle is important in understanding deer behavior. The rut or mating season usually begins in the fall as does go into estrus for a period of a few days and males become more aggressive, competing for mates. Does may mate with more than one buck? 